did it. Johnny, Hanako kept her word. Looking at you now reminds me of the moment we met. I still see that same small time mark, little thief with his head in the clouds. Haven't changed a bit. Got it all wrong. No way that me would have ever made it this far. Just wouldn't have survived. I had to grow stronger. And I did. Maybe. But that V also couldn't stomach betrayal. Wait, that's what you think? I betrayed you? Worse. Lawrence, you betrayed yourself. You got no right to judge me. Couldn't be more wrong. Biochip did more than just blend our memories. That line that kept V and Silverhead separate, well, faded a while back. How's that give you the right to talk down to me? I'm the V who mourns our pal, Jackie. The V who's fucking livid at Brigitte. I'm the V with a heavy conscience. And you. Who are you? Tangled web, you and me. One in the same. So if you're here to tell me something, it's because you need to hear it yourself. Just wanted to talk. One last time. For old time's sake. I'm listening. Listen. I'm on an operating table getting sliced open. Our socket docks are taking the chip out as we speak. I mean, you knew it'd end this way. That the day would come when I'd want to be normal again. Want my life back. Normal is overrated. If it exists at all, they're cutting a piece of us out. And that'll leave a hole forever. That was the deal we made. I'd stay, you'd go. Deal was to fight side by side, have each other's backs. And we did that, we won. Better to die on your feet than live on your knees. You sold a part of yourself, of us, to a megacorp. Was it really worth it? If you're all paranoid about being thrown in another Arasaka prison, don't be. They're gonna shred you. You're never gonna get it. It's not about Arasaka. Not even about life and death. Then what's it all about, Johnny? Enlighten me. The principle, V. It's always about the principle. Swap meat for chrome, live a BD fantasy, whatever. But at the end of it all, it's the code you live by that defines who you are. Ever get lost? It shows you the way home. Bust up into pieces? It puts you back together again. That rocker boy Silverhand's credo? Words he lived by? Something Johnny picked up from V. The old V. Conversation's pointless. Goodbye, Johnny. Remember what Dex asked you? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Sure, I remember. Shame you chose wrong. Damn shame. In addition, numerous brain functions remain dormant. The neural impulses have been rerouted to the neural processor, a temporary measure. When can I expect a full report? I will send it by the end of this week. My congratulations again on your success. Goodbye. Please prepare the patient's room. Having 
trouble remembering how I got here. Some memories you have lost permanently. Others will return in time. You must stay calm. Your neural processor is overburdened. Any unnecessary stress response will only make things worse. Am... Am I still V? I... I died... Twice, I... Everything is in order. No... I... Who am I? Please take the patient away. Notepad. Progression and its further trajectory remain unclear. Removing the tumors proved a difficult task. But the operation on the engram was the real challenge. Let's go. Is the ship of Theseus, dismantled into component parts and reassembled, still the same ship? Um... Please take the patient away. We are pioneers, the first to ever separate mentally conjoined twins. Yes. In the end, even the human soul can go in. End of note. When in Kyoto, I hear the cuckoo calling and long for Kyoto. Huh? Please rest. A doctor will be with you shortly.
come here. Waiting for you. lives once more, though now in the body of his son. The CEO was reported dead months ago, but now it's been revealed that a copy of his consciousness was made before his death. It appears his consciousness was used to override that of his son and heir Yorunobu Arasaka. This shocking development was revealed at a press conference earlier today. Minasan, irashya, sohu wa yoku, kare ochita hana wa.枝に戻らないと言っていました。人は誰も物心ついた瞬間から死を恐れるものです。ついに人類最大の恐怖が克服されました。私、サブロアラサカは今息子の体を使い皆さんの前に立っています。私は彼を愛する父のためにそれを返してくれたのです。私の居ない間、頼信は会社を変革しようといくつかの決定を下しましたが、これは過ちでした。私の指揮のもと、荒坂社は元の姿を取り戻します。Today is truly a historic day. Today, technology has fulfilled the promise left empty by religion. Saburo Osama, Makotoni Omeda. Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. No, good morning. No, got some good news for you. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. Parietal lobe examination. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. And it was a sight to behold, he said, how a soul would choose its life. Sometimes pitiable, sometimes laughable, at times wonderful and strange. That's enough. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Please link yourself to the device. Higher order representation formation initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. What are these tests meant to test? Initiate device calibration. Respond to the keywords. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Journey. Johnny. Home. Uh, I don't know. Enemy. Me. Principal. Our soccer. Betrayal. The city. You're in a cornfield. 
tall green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. What's this test for anyway? It tests your level of empathy. The heat has made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine has torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. What's wrong with me? A shadow gradually falls over the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. Hmm. Yes. Right. Measurements complete. How'd I do? We will see. Motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Please connect to the device. What's this test all about? Please walk. Gradually accelerate. What's this supposed to prove? Shit. Get up. You can't stay here. Welcome to N64 News. I'm Jillian Jordan. The world remains gripped by the revelation that Saburo Arasaka has returned from the dead in the body of his son, Yorinobu Arasaka. A letter of protest regarding the apparent resurrection has been signed by religious leaders, human rights groups, and Virtue 100 company CEOs. This is an abomination born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Saburo Arasaka's seizure of power is in violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor? Not only their livelihoods, but even their bu- You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! Life is not for trade! Life is not- But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite. Gaibu no katagata ni toyakaku iwareru sujiwai wa arimasen.性を受けることに許可が必要ない以上、蘇ることも同様であると考えるべきです。私が息子を殺めたなどという主張は事実無根。法的根拠もありません。合意の上での身体の譲与は一種の寄付に分類することができ、殺人には到底値しません。殺人
solve the cube. Next test, please connect your personal link. Higher order representation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. Let's start this thing. Device calibration. Please respond to each keyword with your initial association. As quick as I can, no thinking, got it. Illness. Death. Rebellion. Johnny. I, me. Emptiness. The present. Hell. The future. No idea. You're in a cornfield. Tall green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is in your eyes, bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. The heat's made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine is torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. The shadow gradually covers the ground, the first rain cloud of the year. Measurements complete. We will now move on to the motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Personal link. Really aced it last time, didn't I? Slow walk. No, no point to this. The tests are necessary. They must be performed. Uh, treadmill. Hmm. Testing concluded for today. Communications have been unlocked. You may now phone home. Earth. Hey. Hey. Wow, it's been a while since I heard that voice. Listen, I'm... I'm stuck in a shithole. It sucks hard. So leave the shithole. Come home. It's not that simple. No is a nice word. Beautiful sometimes. You should use it more often. Sorry, Mitch is about to blow a fuse. I'll have to call you back. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube.
tensions between Arasaka Corp and Militech escalated to troubling levels. Many pundits and analysts warned of a possible outbreak of armed conflict. The exacerbation of tensions was heightened when your noble Arasaka assumed leadership following his father's death and accused Militech of his murder. However, in an unexpected shift, the return of Saburo Arasaka appears to have diffused the situation between the rival megacorporations. Saburo Arasaka and NUS President Rosalind Myers have agreed to meet in person to lay the groundwork for a lasting peace. A first step of goodwill was taken today as the Arasaka CEO withdrew from Night City 15 armored vehicles from the company. Hey, listen. These tests gonna go on much longer? We need very precise data. Can't stand this anymore. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Place it up. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. No. Want to talk to Hanako Arasaka? Please respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Enough! No more tests. I refuse to take any. Please step onto the treadmill. No. As quickly as you can, without thinking about it. V. No. Cognitive function test. Solve the cue. Fuck, no, enough. I've had it. Fucking hate this place. Fuck you all. I'm done! Life is full of surprises. Someone really ought to clean this mess up. What do you want? They asked me to speak to you. Fine. So what do you have to tell me? I fear I'm the bearer of bad news. Listen to me. The procedure was a success. We removed the biochip. 
but the damage it wrought proved enormous. At the genetic level, altered DNA. The kind you would find in those suffering from radiation sickness. And sadly, it's lethal. So you're telling me I'm gonna die? All the options have yet to be exhausted. What other options are there? Already gone under the knife once. Arasaka Corporation has the capability to cheat death. All we require from you is a dose of trust. Trusted you once already. Fat lot of good that did me. You may join our pilot program. Secure your soul. I fear your body is no longer of any use. You must abandon it. We will create an engram of your mind and store it in Mikoshi. Store it? Why can't I just get a new body? We have yet to solve the compatibility issue. Doesn't sound like you had much of a problem with Saburu Arasaka. You have no offspring. Nor do you have an entire clinic focused solely on your care. So let's say I agree. I'll land in Arasaka's soul prison. Put myself at their mercy. Do I even need to ask about the catch? All is set forth in a contract, guaranteed therein. You must merely sign it. If you wish to live, that is. Now, since a digitized psyche is not legally an individual, the contract entails relinquishing your rights. A temporary measure, naturally. No, not about to become the property of our Osaka Corp. Current participants of the program are all well-known, influential people. We have yet to receive any complaints. And if I refuse? Your belongings are packed. A shuttle will take you back to Earth, and you will be dead before winter. It's no easy decision, I know. You should think it through carefully. Made my decision. I'm going back to Earth. Going home. You will die there. Goodbye, Anders. Your offer was shit. But in making it, you gave me something better. What are you talking about? Before, death was inevitable. A fact of my shit life. You let me choose it. Accept it on my terms.
How's the Earth looking from way up there? She is pretty as they say. Or is that just another lie? Listen, don't forget, your implants were made for Earth gravity. Could start acting up in orbit. What I'm trying to say is, don't ignore any arrow warnings, okay? And when you're back, I mean, if you come back, I'll do a full checkup. Maybe even give you a little discount. Take care, V. Um... Hey, V. I was just wondering how you've been. Haven't heard from you in a while. Still living large in Night City? I don't know. <laughs> All I think about is dropping everything and leaving. <laughs> Yet... Here I am, still. Well, the city's like quicksand. The more you try to get out, the more it pulls you in. Once you're up to your knees, you're never getting out. Like... Like Evelyn. Anyway. Look out for yourself, okay? And call me sometime. Bye. Hey, V. It's Pan Am. Remember me? The one with the car? Listen, you wouldn't happen to have any gigs to spare, would you? I'm not picky or anything. I'll take whatever pays the rent. If you've got something, or you know someone who does, give me a call, okay? I really appreciate it. So, yeah, uh, that's it. Catch you sometime in the afterlife, maybe. Hello, V. Saul speaking. From the Elder Caldos. Um, I heard some big noise coming out at Night City with, uh, you involved. No idea what that was all about. But, um, if you're ever in trouble, I need a hand or a place to disappear. We're here. You saved an Elder Caldos life. And we will never forget that. It's a debt we're happy to owe. Stay in touch, V. Hey, V. It's me, Mitch, remember? You saved my ass from Kang Tao. Well, it doesn't matter if you don't remember, because... Because I do. Anyway, if you ever need help with anything, I got your back. All right? You just give me a call, and I'm in Night City before you know it. It doesn't matter if you want someone to disappear, or if you need lunch brought to your office. Literally anything. All right? All right, take care now. Gotta hand it to you, V. I'm impressed. When you told me you were gonna go after Hellman, I was sure you'd come back as a garbage bag full of smithereens. But you did it. I'm not usually wrong about people and what they're capable of. I'm curious to see what else you've got in ya. If you're looking for your next job, you know where to find me. Hello, V. From what I understand, you have less than six months to live. I do not know how you plan to spend this time. Perhaps you have chosen to put your feet up, rest, ponder life's meaning. Or perhaps you continue to do what you are good at. If that is the case, my father and I would gladly retain your services. You would be compensated generously. Six months will pass faster than you imagine. It would be a shame to let this time go to waste. Hey V, orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. 
The Fool, the Moon, the High Priestess. Those, uh, those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. <laughs>